Airtel recently announced their Vio Wi-Fi solution in select circles across India and we've also been hearing about Jio looking to roll out their voiceover Wi-Fi services soon as well. So what is this new technology and why are we excited about it? Let's find out in today's video. Hey guys, Ash here from C4E Tech and if you do end up liking what you see here, please don't forget to turn on notifications by hitting that bell icon. Let's now get this video started. So VO Wi-Fi or Voice Over Wi-Fi and Volti or Voice Over LTE, they kinda sound similar, don't they? Well, actually they are very similar. The underlying technology here is called VoIP or Voice Over Internet Protocol. Now VOIP is a new technology. In fact, it's existed long before Volti came into existence. VOIP has existed since 1995 as, an, as a way of reducing the costs of placing long distance calls and over the years we have seen many services utilize this technology, services like Skype. Now without going into too much detail, VoIP takes the analog data signals that is our voices, it converts them into digital signals that is a bunch of zeros and ones and then converts them into data signals that can be sent over the internet. Now, in the case of Volti, that's the LTE network. Now that is helpful for us as consumers so that we actually end up getting better voice quality, which is what some service providers market as HD calls. Thus, in the case of LTE only networks like say Geo, uh, their towers are, ca are capable of only capturing and sending internet data and not analog signals. This is why unlike other networks, Geo cannot fall back on 3G or 2G. And unless you have LTE internet connection, there is no way, no way of making voice calls. Anyway, 4G, 3G and the different network types, they are a topic for an entirely different video. Now let's return back to VO Wi-Fi. So what VO Wi-Fi does is it uses the same technology as Volti, but instead of sending it via a cellular network, it sends the data across a Wi-Fi network. Airtel right now restricts VO Wi-Fi to only Airtel broadband users why? Because it's Airtel and Airtel does Airtel things and Airtel is Airtel. But in reality, VO Wi-Fi can be used across any Wi-Fi network from any provider, technically rather, including even a hotspot. Airtel has said this support for other broadbands, it would come eventually. Okay, so what are the benefits of using VO Wi-Fi? Well, in many offices and houses, as well uh, as some remote locations, the cell signal becomes weak as the cellular waves cannot penetrate through multiple walls. And in some cases, the distance between the location and the cell tower is just too great. Like, for example, right here, we have no Vodafone reception. I need to use two SIM cards, a Vodafone and a Geo, just to make sure that I get signal, I get connectivity inside the house. Uh, and I need the Vodafone because Vodafone has better uh, international roaming. Now, in cases like this, uh, we see multiple connectivity problems, including uh, dropping voice calls, not being able to connect to a network, like what, that is what I'm experiencing. Now, VO Wi-Fi would solve these problems since as long as you have a decent enough Wi-Fi connection, calls on VO Wi-Fi will remain crystal clear. In fact, we tried out a couple of calls uh, with Airtel and the call clarity was really amazing. Better than what Volti uh, is at my location. Also, our office, like I said, is notorious for dropping calls. But with VO Wi-Fi, I was able to roam around the house and still maintain a stable connection without the other person's voice cutting out. Airtel also claims that VO Wi-Fi calls are faster to connect than other calls. Well, that kind of makes sense given how much faster Volti calls are to connect on Geo. Now, once you are connected to a VO Wi-Fi network, different phones will show it, show it in different ways. On OnePlus devices, we tested out uh, VO Wi-Fi shows up as this tiny logo. See here, instead of Volti, it's now VO Wi-Fi. And while making calls, you get this. On Xiaomi devices, we have this signal of a telephone receiver with Wi-Fi bars on top uh, instead of your regular signal bar. Also do remember that in order to use this feature, as of now you need a 4G Airtel SIM, one of the smartphones mentioned in this website and an Airtel broadband connection. Yes, even though the connection is made through Wi-Fi, 
you still need the SIM card inside the device to be able to make calls. So it's not a VOIP call service like WhatsApp, Discord or any, anything else like that. After that, we need to click on enable voice over Wi-Fi option from SIM settings. And that's pretty much it, VO Wi-Fi pops up. If it doesn't show up right away, try updating your device to the latest firmware. Now we tested it out with a few SIMs and with Amartya's Airtel SIM from Kolkata, it did not work. So your mileage may vary with this one. Now Geo is also supposed to be testing out the same feature in select circles. So I wanna see if they do end up restricting what broadband uh, networks it would work with. Uh, or they adopt a more consumer friendly and open rollout. Oh, and I almost forgot to mention, there are no added costs for using VO Wi-Fi. Uh, so if you're using one of Airtel's unlimited call plans, then you won't be charged anything extra for this. If you're using their normal call rates, then there won't be a change in that either. So uh, over, it's just a quality of life improvement. There are no cost savings for us. Uh, as the consumer. Maybe Geo might change that, but we'll have to wait and see. For now, this is a short little video on VO Wi-Fi. What the tech is, how good it is, and most importantly, why is it a big deal? Let me know in the comments below if you've used VO Wi-Fi and what you feel about this new technology. Also do let me know if your phone has the support for VO Wi-Fi and if you think this is a feature that you might, uh, I mean, you would find useful. Uh, and I guess that's pretty much it. Thumbs up, thumbs down based on what you felt about this video. Subscribe, turn on notifications by hitting that bell icon if you haven't yet. Thanks a lot for watching. Till next time, my name is Ash. You've been watching C4 Retech and I'm signing off for now. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye.